Assalamu alaikum and hi, my name is Mama Firdaus bin G. Abdul. I am a student from class ILM 34 of Finance, Safety and Health. Today, I will be sharing to you guys this video about an important info regarding personal protective equipment. Personal protective equipment or can be called SPP refers to protective clothing, SPP refers to protective clothing, helmets, goggles, gloves, face mask, respirator or other garments or equipment designed to protect the wearer's body from injury or infection. The type of PPE used will vary based on the level of precautions required such as standard and contact, droplet or airborne infection isolation precautions. The procedure for putting on and removing PPE should be tailored to the specific ways. First, gown. It is to fully cover torso from neck to knees, arms to end of wrist, and also you have to wrap around the neck. You also have to fasten in back of neck and waist. Second, mask or respirator. You have to sit here, take your ties or elastic bands at the middle of head and neck. It also have to fit flexible band to the fridge with snap to face and below chin and also you have to fit check the respirator. Goggles or face shield. You have to place over your face and eyes and adjust it to fit your face. Lastly, glove. It is to extend to cover wrist of isolation gown. By wearing this kit, it will provide better health as it works to protect yourself against health or safety risk. It also reduce yourself to the exposure of hazards. Last but not least, the limitation of PPE. PPE needs to be removed before going home. Contamination on your PPE can follow you home from work and expose others in your household. PPE needs to be in good working condition to protect you. And if PPE is found to be defective, it should be discarded and replaced.